Happy Friday to the entire world. We have a very interesting case. We have a young patient who recently presented to our, to our office with a chief complaint of pain to the medial aspect of the right foot. Diagnosis, insertional posterior tibial tendonitis. Exactly. We have a very important tendon, and we're gonna keep this very, very short and sweet. We have a very important tendon called the posterior tibial tendon. This is the tendon that holds up right here. Oh, it got, I guess it got cut off, but it's, it inserts into the, into the navicular. And this is a tendon responsible pro, for providing the arch. Posterior tibial tendon, tendon responsible for providing the arch. For whatever reason, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, this tendon can become inflamed at the level of the insertion of the bone, the navicular. So I have already recommended, we recommended the, the Gucci boot, okay? And already in just a couple days, the patient has clearly told me mm -hmm. that the area is feeling better. But in order to maximize improvement and minimize any long-term complications, such as what? Partial tear of the tendon, or God forbid, a full tear of the tendon, I recommended a PRP injection. PRP, acronym, platelet-rich plasma injection. We draw blood, we spin the patient's blood. Blood separates into good and bad. The bad we throw away, the good we keep. That is the PRP, the platelet-rich plasma. Platelets play a role in coagulation. Dr. Wagner, what does Platelets and coagulation have to do with this. The platelets actually contain growth factors and important cells that aid in the regeneration of damaged tissue. And in, you know, uh, the cliff note version lower, lowers inflammation. So it regenerates damaged tissue and reduces inflammation. And then de delivers this bolus, right? Whoosh, of growth factors into the affected area. PRP. So we're going to go ahead and infiltrate the area with PRP. V block has been already performed. V block means, again, it's a type of block, local nerve conduction block, aka the area is numb. Here we go. We've already demarcated the area. Patient understands that there may be some, uh, a little bit of discomfort. All the way in. I know the needle's right here. And very slowly. Patient, here we go. Pain? No. Pain? Just discomfort. A lot or little? A little. Pain? Not yet. Pain? It's getting more uncomfortable though. Okay, how about now? No worse. Worse? A little bit. Tolerable? Yes. Okay, good. I'm gonna stop now, okay? Uh-huh. How are you today? It's getting sore. Well, it's gonna throb a little bit. How about now? Yep. Still the same? Mm-hmm. Okay, we're almost done here. Okay. And we're done. Okay? Okay. Okay. We were able to actually... Okay, so... <clears throat> I've said it before and I'll say it again. PRP, even with anesthesia, mm -hmm. can be uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. I think she's being kind. <laughs> she's, she's saying, uh-huh, uh-huh. It's very uncomfortable. It could be uncomfortable 
Um, the the problem is that I've said it before. You know, you have uh, I already chucked it, but you have the local anesthesia, which we'll call synthetic, right? That's synthetic, and then we have the natural, which is this, right? This is a natural living cells. So we don't want to mix the good with the bad because this will affect that. Mm -hmm. That's why we try to, when we do these, when we numb the areas, we try to stay away from that, you know, affected area. What, what happens now? Nothing. The patient goes back into the boot. This is a physiological process. It takes time. This is not like a miracle injection. The throbbing will continue for about another five minutes. Oh, okay. And then after that, poof. Oh, really? Okay. It'll be gone. Okay. This is not stem cell therapy, ladies and gentlemen. It is not. This is PRP therapy. Platelet-rich plasma therapy. Put up your foot. Up, 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 up. <laughs> As always, www.jalspodiatry.com, Instagram, Dr. Tojam, Jal's Podiatry, Facebook, and, and let's get on Lisa, our YouTube channel, Jal's Healthcare. For all of the people that are um, following all the subscribers from uh, YouTube, Highly recommend. There's a lot of great content. You guys don't believe me. There's a lot of great content. Uh, our Facebook fan page, tons of stuff that you will not find on our on our uh, on our YouTube channel. And the same thing goes for the Instagram page. Uh, you may see some things here and there that kind of look similar, but there's a lot of, especially in the Facebook fan page, Jaws Podiatry. Give us a like. Have a wonderful weekend.